What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, yeah, we went through the Mount Moon, and uh, well, it is finally time for us to go straight to the Viridian Forest and Viridian City because, well, we got business to take care of. Plus, uh, plus, we, we, we I think, you know, I, I think it's very easy to say that we're very, very close to finishing up our, you know, our gym excursion right here in Kanto. And, uh, well, I cannot wait to finish it up because, well, shoot. That, that pretty much means that we're going to be done with this walkthrough. And, uh, well, look at that. We're kicking some butt, taking some names, Togepri. Learning some moves. And last resort right here is the move that can use only after the user has used all the other moves it knows in battle. So that right there is, uh... Yeah, when when do you guys ever see me use all the moves? And here we have a B drill, so let's go ahead and go with the flamethrower for the win. Now, while this is happening, let's go right ahead and take away that that item, the experience share. We've been using it a lot for you know the majority of our Pokemon, mainly because well, yeah, we need to get to level 50. We got two more gym battles, and both gym leaders are going to be pretty hard, so. Give it to good old uh, Hercules right here because it needs love. It really does. So here we go into the Vir uh, Vermilion or Viridian Forest. If you guys don't remember, in the old games such as Gold, Silver, Crystal, uh, Viridian Forest got taken away. Big mistake. I mean, it got made into a maze, and yeah, it it, it was a big mistake on my. Like, in my opinion, because it was like, wow, they just took, like, the meat and, pota meat and potatoes of the whole thing right here. I mean, it's not just that, but they took away, I guess they took away the Safari Zone. They took away just a, a bunch of memorable stuff from uh, from the original series that we kind of wanted to see in the original games. But, you know, thankfully, they brought it back right here with the exception of the Safari Zone and Fuchsia. Instead, you get yourself a, what was it called, uh... Yeah, instead you get yourself the Pal Park, which is, I guess it's even better, mainly because you get to send any Pokemon you've uh, you've had in Pokemon Heart Gold or in Pokemon Fire Red, Leaf Green, Alpha, or Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. You get to use those guys, and this is a large tree, and here we found ourselves a full restore. That's always nice, and, well, let's see. Yeah, we're gonna be, we're gonna be going through a lot right here, finding some items. And here we found ourselves a dire hit. That's always nice to have right here, too. And, well, let's see. Well, if you guys remember, in Pokemon, in the original Pokemon games, there were some trainers right here, but, you know, bug type trainers, not that. They're not that imposing because they usually have the same kind of Pokemon. Kind of like Weedle right here. And eventually they evolve them, which kind of like, you know, okay, why couldn't they just do that? But. It is what it is, and here comes Kakuna, and there we go, flamethrower for the win. And, well, let's go right ahead and see what else we can actually find. We found ourselves another item right here. And here we found ourselves a blue flute. That, let's see what it, let's, let's see what this one does. So let's go with the uh, battle items, let's see. Going to the very last one, and, huh. Did we already have a blue flute? I don't know. There's a black flute. Where's the blue flute? Okay, so I don't know where the blue flute's at. Either that or I'm just like passing it by. Holy crud. Okay, where's the blue flute? We got a black flute. Where's the blue flute? Okay, so what about this? Uh, well, shoot. Huh. Never. Wait, hold on just a sec. Uh, battle items right here. Okay, so... Oh, there we go. Okay, so the blue flute right here is a single... It's a melody awakens a single Pokemon from sleep. So it looks like to me, it's kind of like the... It's kind of like the Poke flute, except you, it's a, it's a one-use item. And yeah, kind of... Yeah, it's kind of like a... You really don't need to use that, you know. You can use any other methods and stuff. So let's go straight for Hercules. And there we go. Aerial Ace for the win. And let's go right ahead one more time. Aerial Ace again. And there you go. Look at that. Alrighty. And, well, here we have more of these Bug-type trainers. And <laughs> we'll scare the Bug-type away. And it's kind of like fish. You just don't want to, like, scare them off. And, well, there we go. Defeated him. 
And I see another item right there. Now, you do need a Pokemon with Cut just uh, to go through shortcuts right here. And here we found ourselves in TM77, which is Psyka. And, well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and use another uh, Repel because we do not want to get attacked by these Pokemon. And, you know, the funny thing is that the Pokemon here, same level as, you know, the original game. They, there was no boost. You might find a rare Pokemon here and there, but that's just about it. And, well, here we go again. Another B, B drill. I'm really glad that they just, like, evolved their Pokemon, but damn. And here comes a Butterfree, so let's go straight for Cinder right here. And go with a Flamethrower attack. And just like that, we get to level 56. Yes. Okay, so our mother will be calling us again because, well, you know, she likes to buy stuff. And I'm trying to look for some more items right here. And, well, we have found two things. Or one thing right here. So this one will lead us right here. This is the Leaf Stone. Which, if you guys don't know, in, well, in any Johto game, uh, elemental stones come, they're, they're very hard to come by just because, well, shoot, um, yeah. Just because, uh, well, I don't know, I don't, I don't think they sell them anymore, and, well, crud. There might be a, a real, uh, there might be a, an item right there that we might need, so let's see. Let's see if we can actually teach somebody cut right here, so let's see. Cut. Okay, so who can learn cut right here? Three Pokemon. Hmm. I don't want to risk it. I really don't. I could give it to Dark Side right here. Dark Side. I could take away Earthquake, but that's just a way. So, you know what? We're going to save that until later. We're going to do off screen stuff, in anyways. Yeah, so. Oh, wow. Okay, so I need to get out of this. Yes, quit trying, and there we go. Anywho, let's go right ahead and get the heck out of uh, the Viridian Forest and move on ahead right here. So, the Viridian Forest, done and done and done. Now we're heading into Route 2, and our Repel has worn off. But look at this. They've actually increased... Well, they've given a, a Pokemon right here. And this guy saying, like, why do why do girls dislike... Uh, why do girls dislike Bug-type Pokemon? Because girls don't like anything icky and stuff. Wow. So here comes an Ariados. And let's go straight for a Nessie right here. And let's go with an Ice Beam. And just like that, we win again. Holy crud. Okay. And, yes, he would like to educate us in Bug-type Pokemon. So let's let's just get his phone number and hopefully... He never calls. Now, we're going to be switching it up right here. Let's go with Nessie. Now, we got three Pokemon left to get to level 50s. Wow, it has been a struggle right here. And, well, he's like, my bug Pokemon are tough. Prepare to lose. Okay. And, well, here we go. Here comes Beedrill. And we're going to go in with an Ice Beam attack right there. And let's continue the Ice Beams. Yes. And Hercules grows to level 48, which is great. And yes, more phone numbers because, well, we're the most popular guy out there. And, uh, well, here we are, guys. We finally made it to Viridian City. And hey, kid, just had a double, sh a double shot of espresso, and I am wired. I need to talk to someone, so you'll have to do. I might not look like much now, but I was an expert at catching Pokemon. Do you believe me? Well, yeah, I mean, you are the trigger to the missing no event so yeah <laughs> anywho here we are guys in viridian city and this place not much because well this gym has uh, didn't have a leader a young man from pallet town became the the leader but he's opted away which is true and uh well again as always viridian city not that big not that you know it's not that big nor is it you know it's just, yeah, it's nothing. It's really nothing. And, uh, I don't know what else to say, except that there is one improvement to this whole place, and that is the, pa I guess, the battle, uh, the battle arcade, or whatever it's called again, the battle center, let's see, the trainer house. So what we're gonna do right now, guys, is we're gonna heal up our Pokemon, and we're gonna be going straight to the trainer house, so I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so we're healed up and ready to go, and before we do anything, guys, let's go right ahead and surf right here. And get attacked by a Pokemon, of course, you can find Poliwatch right here in, uh, in Cerulean City. Now, if you go right here, talk to this guy, he's like, yawn, I must have dozed off in the sun. I had this dream about a drowsy eating my dream. Weird, huh? Huh? What's this? Where did this TM come from? This is spooky. Here, you can have this TM. And here we get ourselves the TM-85, 
This right here is Dream Eater, and it, well, it, it is useful if you want to just mess around with some Pokemon trainers and all that stuff. It does, it does require you to put, put a Pokemon to sleep, and, uh, you know, it's a two-part combination and all that stuff. So, here we are in the, in the trainers, uh, well, in the battle club, and all you gotta do now is come down here. Now, every single day you can battle a single trainer, and as you can see, this lady's like, oh, hello! Right this way, please. This is the trainer house, the place for trainers. The Pokewalker will bring your friends here. You can challenge various trainers once a day. You'll earn battle points when you win. Bring your, bring out your best. Oh, I'll borrow your VS recorder for uh, for a moment. Let's see, slide open this part there, and a tick a tick a chick a chunk there, and all done. Now you can check your Pokemon, or you can check your battle points using your VS recorder. You may exchange battle points for, or for fabulous prizes at Johto, or the, the Johto Battle Frontier. Now that you are ready, would you like to train yourself? Sure, let's go right ahead. And we're gonna be... This automatically saves our game, and I guess this is kind of like the secret, the secret bases in Hoenn. You swap out records, and you'll be able to battle just about anybody. So what we're gonna be doing right here is... I have a feeling he's gonna come out with like, well, let's see. You know what, let's go with Cinder. Now, if you haven't swapped out anything, you will be battling a, a, well, you'll be battling a bland version of a Pokemon Trainer. This guy right here, his name is Cow, and he'll have the evolved forms, the fully evolved forms of the three starter Johto Pokemon, so just be aware of that. So let's go right ahead and go with a Flamethrower. And yeah, this guy's gonna be hard. Well, it's gonna be tough and here he comes out with for alligator and of course you won't be able to switch so you can switch you'll be losing a turn of course that I really don't mind and as you guys can see I am getting my butt kicked because oh yeah we can't use items are you serious holy crud okay so that right there saved me and we got to switch out Pokemon right here so let's go with Nessie and let's go with a surf attack right here Focus Blast kicks our butt. Let's go with Hercules and Hercules. Let's go with Close Combat and wow, this guy is kicking our butt. So let's go with Dark Side. Wow, okay, so Earthquake Attack. What the hell? Oh my god, okay, so this guy is kicking our butts. All right, Togepi, do your thing. Ancient Power and there we go. And Focus Blast is kicking our butt. So Typhlosion is kicking our butt right here. All right, here we go. Discharge attack and another focus blast. Holy crud. This guy is gonna kick our butt Okay, so we are poisoned and it looks like to me we're gonna have to risk it and here we go And there we go. We barely defeat this guy. Oh, wow <laughs> Oh my god, okay, so yeah, we want to exit I want to talk to my mom. We barely beat this guy and holy crud. Okay, so I guess that's like <laughs> Oh man, we need to train some more. This is the place where you need to be strategic, guys. Literally be strategic. Anywho, let's get the heck out of here and move on ahead. Okay, so now the next the next area we have to go to happens to be what was it? Pewter? No, 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 Pallet Town. And here we are in Route One. And to our surprise, there's going to be quite a few changes. Kind of like there's a tree that's grown. Look at that. We get ourselves a black apricorn. That's always nice. And yes, there will be trainers here. And these trainers are going to be very, very, very strong. So yes, let's go take on some trainers right here. And there we go. And here comes a Pidgeot. So let's go with Fluff Volt and get some uh, revenge right here. And there we go. And just like that, we win again. Okay, so let's see. We're going to be battling all these trainers. I really don't care, but look at this. These guys have some pretty good Pokemon and all. And, well, here comes Electabuzz. This guy this guy has all the pseudos. So here we go. Earthquake attack. And just like that, we win. And, well, let's continue it on right here. Earthquake for the win. And, yes, we win. Okay, so look at that. Now, I think we have like two more trainers left. So let's go right ahead. And let's see, he's got himself an Absol. This Pokemon is just a beast and it's a very, very, very good physical attacker. And well, coming out with an Alakazam, there we go. And well, yeah, we're kicking some butt, taking some names and we gotta switch out Pokemon right here because 
Yeah, we need Pokemon to get to level 50 right away. And, well, here we have a female trainer. So let's go right ahead and see what she's all about. And I picked out the right Pokemon, I guess. And just like that. And, well, let's go with the... Let's see. Let's go with the Body Slam. And that Thunderbolt is going to mess us up just a little bit. So here we go. Body Slam for the win. And there you go. Mother is calling us the Madre. And... Yeah, we're gonna get attacked by a Pokemon now. Funny thing is that you can encounter Latias or Latios if you're playing the other version. And here we are, guys. Pallet Town. The place where it all began. Where all our adventures began. And if you guys can see, Red's house and Blue's house. Look at that. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk to some people right here. Stop moving. I'm raising Pokemon too. They serve as my private guards. Okay. So let's go right ahead and see what this is all about. Now, if you talk to our mama right here, she's like, Hi! Red's been away. He hasn't, uh, he hasn't called either, so I have no idea where he is or what he's doing. They say no news is good news, but I worry about him. Little does she realize. Well, you'll, you'll, you'll eventually see, but as you guys can see, this, uh, yeah, he hasn't been used in a long time. Old boy has been gone, and, you know, from what I got in the stories was that he got a little tired of being the champion and whatnot. So, he decided to disappear and, and all that, so I, I guess that's a good storyline. Never talks. He's a quick talker and all that stuff. I don't even know. And here is Daisy, the the sister, the older sister of, uh, what was it, of Gary, or Blue. And let's see. Hi! My kid brother is, in the, gym, is the gym leader of the Viridian City. But he goes out uh, out of town often and causes problems for the trainers. Hmm. You don't say. Okay, so the place we need to go to is right here, Professor Oak's lab, and well, there he is, and he's gonna be like, Ah, Draven, it's good to see you come all this way to Kanto. What do you think of the trainers here? Pretty tough, huh? Ah, uh, you collecting gym badges? I imagine it's pretty hard to. Uh, it's a pretty it. Or, I imagine it's pretty hard, but the experience will surely help you. Come see me when you get all of them. I have a gift for you. And keep it up, Draven. So, how is your Pokedex coming? And, well, let's go ahead and get that National Dex. And, well, it is 242 Pokemon and 102 Pokemon cut. That is pretty cool. And don't forget, some Pokemon only appear in certain times of the day. Which, uh, well, I, I do know that. But, won't be doing that quite later on. So, anywho, guys, we're going to pause it right here. In the next episode, I believe we're going to have two gym battles because, well, we kind of want to do that. I don't know. We really need to do it. So, anywho, guys, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being uh, supportive and all that. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, I got myself a merch, uh, merch store. If you guys want to support, GLD, official GLD uh, stuff down there below. Other than that, guys, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being supportive. I'll see you guys next time.